our fifth problem looks a little complicated but let's go one by one and here we have the production rate of a material which is being made in a factory and it depends on two factors f1 and f2 as r is equal to f1 into f2 and these two factors they are the functions of the purity of the raw material and that variable is x x is the purity of the raw material and both these functions are given to be linear f1 of x is ax plus b f2 of x is minus cx plus d and it is given that a b c d are all positive and it is asked find the purity of material that is the value of x for which the production is maximum so let's understand what is being done here we have two linear functions and the rate of production r is f1 f2 which will then be ax plus b into minus cx plus so that gives us minus AC x square plus AD x minus BC x plus BD and this gives us minus AC x square plus AD minus BC x plus BD. We are told that a, B, C, D are all positive and that indicates the coefficient of x square is negative because the negative of A into C and that means this is a quadratic function whose parabola is downturned therefore we will be able to get a maximum value at some point and this is going to be at the vertex we know that this is going to be at the vertex so the vertex is at minus b by 2a that is because here we have a b c d already let us write it down more carefully that is the negative of coefficient of x divided by 2 times the coefficient of x square which in our case will be then negative of a d minus b c divided by 2 times minus a c minus and minus cancels off so we get a d minus b c divided by 2 a c is where we will get the vertex and since we know that the maximum is going to occur at this particular x we get the x is equal to a d minus b c divided by 2 a c 